This is the Farms.com Soybean Report, brought to you by Mycogen Seeds. Mycogen Seeds, driven by your success. Hi, I'm Holly Lucas, uh, customer agronomist with Dow AgroSciences, and uh, we are out in a field of beans this afternoon. Um, can talk to you a bit about some soybean growth stages and why it's important to have an idea of the stage of growth your beans are at and follow them throughout the season. Um, so initially there are some vegetative stages where your beans, they emerge, they come up out of the ground and they start to grow leaves. Um, and that's not a critical stage for, for their development. Um, they just need to put on some leaves and get growing and get growing through the soil, start putting the nodules on in the soil and um, just basically become a healthy plant. Um, so from a disease standpoint, there's not a whole lot to that you need to worry about at this stage other than your seedling diseases. But from a plant standpoint, that's when you want to get your best weed control is when those plants haven't filled the rows yet. They're small enough. You can drive through with the sprayer. You're not going to get a lot of damage. Um, but you want to reduce their competition with any weeds that are going to grow within the row at that point. Um, so they only, you have your beans. They're taking up all the nutrients and getting all the available water. Uh, beyond that, when the beans start to flower is when you start going into the reproductive stages or R stages. Um, so at this point, the plants are starting to flower and this is when you're going to start um, to get pollination and start having pods form on the plants. And this is where you're starting to get into critical times for your yield. Once those pods are on the plant and the flowers are open and, and waiting to be pollinated, um, that's where your yield comes from and that's where you're going to get your beans. So um, going into those stages, um, the early R stages are when you want to be um, um, if you're going to apply just a preventative fungicide, um, that would be the best time to put that on, um, as well as carrying on through pod set and um, watching to see if you have any diseases. If you're going to put a preventative fungicide on is later on in the R stages when you're wanting to protect the plant that's there to fill the beans. Um, as well, there's some foliar nutrients you can put on, some micronutrients uh, later in the season, and those are later in the R stages as well as when the best timing is for those. So keeping an eye on your plants and knowing what stage they're at is important, and then watching the guidelines of various products to make sure you're applying them correctly, and you want to get them on, if you're going to get the best bang for your buck, you need to get them on timely um, when the beans are going to be most effective. Um, so we have a great chart that you can, you can look at for um, to get your staging for your beans gives you a brief description of what each stage entails and um, you know you don't have to be totally precise you don't have to make any measurements or anything um, just kind of by eye because uh, the stages are critical but not you know you don't have to be down to the second so have a look at the chart figure out where your beans are use it as a guideline um, to get an idea and you want to scout your whole field you don't just want to look in one you know the biggest area of the field you want to kind of get a represent representative of the average of the stage that that whole field would be at uh, so here we have a soybean that's at the R3 stage and the R3 stage is a a small pod that's around five millimeters in length so about a quarter of an inch um, at the top four nodes so we've got one two three and the fourth node from the top of the plant um, that's around a quarter of an inch or five millimeters in length is your R3 stage um, so any product that's good to spray around an R3 stage um, or apply um, this would be you know the size of your plant so this plant is an R4 stage plant. Um, the R4 stage is, has a pod that is two centimeters or three quarters of an inch um, in length at the fourth, any, in any of the nodes at the top four nodes of the plant. Um, so that's this little guy here as well. You can see some older ones um, down through the canopy. You get some larger pods, but the top four nodes of the plant is what you would stage it at for R4. Um, and like um, any of the other stages, any product that's you want to apply it in R4 stage, this is the stage you would use. Uh, so if you'd like any more information on any agronomy or um, some staging of your soybeans, um, your territory sales rep is available as well as myself, um, the uh, customer agronomist with Dow Sciences. Um, we can uh, either through email or by the phone or coming out looking at your field, we can answer your questions and provide you with some more information. This has been the Farms.com Soybean Report, sponsored by Mycogen Seeds.